Susan. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. I hope everybody has been having a really great Halloween season. I know for most of us it is definitely at least one or two months long, <laughs> um, if not more, if not always <laughs> in our worlds. But um, I hope you guys are having a good Halloween season. And, uh, I have part makeup from something else I was doing and then I tried to add to it so um, that's why everything looks a little different than usual, my eyebrows and all of that. So anyway, that said, I wanted to come on here because I received this and it is enormous. It's the Creepy Crate by the lineup, but this package is a lot bigger than the normal Creepy Crate. I'm really excited, I'm assuming because of all the, the coolness on the box, that it is going to be, you know, because of Halloween. So I wanted to open it on camera so you guys could see. I did um, just cut the piece of tape right here, but I have not looked inside. Let me open this, I'll show you guys first. Here is what is inside. We will take a look and see. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, cool. Hey, 10% off at Fright Rags. And you know, I love Fright Rags. Their Halloween collection, the 40th anniversary and the 2018 collection are absolutely incredible. The designs, oh God, great. And I will definitely be using that. And then, okay, this is the spoiler card, so we'll save that and put it aside so that we can be surprised. And I'll just reach in and grab something. Okay, oh, now this is one of the um, old school hotel keychains, and there are an entire, there are, there is an entire line of these with different well-known horror movie hotel keys. Uh, like there's one that says um, the garage from Christine, um, the Munsters, it says 1313 Mockingbird Lane, uh, Psycho Bates Motel, obviously, different things like that, um, The Shining. So this one is Amity Surf Inn, 21 Main Street, uh, 12, drop in any mailbox, we guarantee postage. Amity, as you know, means friendship. So that is Amity Island. That's Jaws, right, you guys? I'm really terrible. I know it's not Amityville House, so it's got to be Jaws, right? <sighs> I can't believe. I'm disappointed in myself, but those are really cute. I enjoy them. And it makes it very easy to find your keys, so, so that's nice. And next we have... Oh, this is hilarious. <laughs> Dustin Henderson. Okay, so this is Dustin's public library card from Stranger Things. And then the actual book card. It says author Gina McIntyre, title Stranger Things, World's Turned Upside Down. And it's due on October 30th of 2018. So that's really cute. This says Hawkins Public Library opening the doors of curiosity and you can actually sign it. And then it is from a website, readstrangerthings.com. So apparently there is an actual book version of Stranger Things. So you guys might want to check that out, uh, readstrangerthings.com. Next item, oh it's a shirt. Okay. Okay, you guys, I'm just I'm just gonna put myself out there. I would leave all the hate. I'm sure I'm supposed to know, but I don't know what who this is or what this is from. It's um, Welcome to the World's Columbian Exposition, 1893, Chicago, Illinois. I but I don't know who that is. I'm embarrassed. Please comment down below and let me know. Feel free to call me a moron. I'm fine with that. Um, but I just don't know. It's a very soft soft shirt. Oh, okay. And this is Dracula novel. Even immortals have their beginnings. And uh, it looks like this is really, really nice. R.L. Stein praised this. Oh, it's about Bram Stoker at 21. 
Okay, so uh, this is very interesting. Definitely something I would be interested in reading. Honestly, I'm still on the one they sent us two or three boxes ago about the Golden State Killer. So it will take a little while before I get to this one, but great pick. I mean, it looks really interesting and really nice quality hardcover book with a slip cover, dust cover. I'm sorry, I'm used to <laughs> Blu-rays and DVDs. And this, is, oh, it's a tote bag, you guys. Oh, well, yes, it's Michael. <laughs> My favorite holiday is Halloween with Michael Myers on it. That's cute. I'll definitely use this, especially conventions and things like that. That's, that's really cute. This is the last item because I put the book back in there. Oh, and this is very well packaged, whatever it is. Thank you, Creepy Crate. Let's see if I can open this with or without my knife. I don't want to get my knife all sticky with tape. Bat knife to the rescue. I will either speed this up, edit it, something, but this is going to take a while. This is really packed very well. And I appreciate that because usually packages are drop kicked or stolen, you guys. I would have done a Terra Threads uh, haul, but my Terra Threads haul was somehow intercepted and stolen. So I'm not too happy about that. If I break this in the process of opening it, I'm going to be really upset. I think this is supposed to look like a tarot card, and I don't mean to be ignorant. I just am not knowledgeable of tarot at all but I think it's supposed to be a tarot card and it looks like it has the Grim, Grim Reaper and it says warmed over but it feels like a nice quality cup does not say if it is dishwasher or microwave safe but that's a nice cup But yeah, great creepy crate. If I had just like a dime for every time I said, uh, you guys don't even know I edit them out. Uh, any, see? Feast your eyes on a box full of horror. And this has six items in it. Oh, H.H. H. Holmes, Murder Castle T, limited edition. Care to stay the night, this exclusive tea features notorious American serial killer H. H. Holmes, who tur lured an untold number of victims into his murder castle during the 1893 Chicago World's Fair. Okay, cool. Um, so Creepy Crate already knows this, this is no big surprise, but um, I personally don't wear or sport anything that has an actual serial killer on it. I have no hate or it, you know anything, any problem with other people. I mean, if that's your thing, that's cool. It's just not mine. So, if you would like this shirt and would wear this shirt, just comment down below and maybe I will send it to you. I'll pick someone at random, whoever. Um, at the size on this is, this is like a men's small. If this is up your alley, if this is something that you would wear, comment down below and it could be yours. Okay, and the next thing is the Warmed Over Death Tarot Card Mug. You guys, I'm not as slow as I thought I was. Okay, it is a tarot card mug. It says, rise and shine from your eternal slumber, inspired by the death tarot card, this one-of-a-kind drinking vessel is the perfect companion for those chilly autumn mornings. It is. It's really cute. And three, the new release hardcover horror novel. Oh, and this is actually penned by Bram Stoker's great-grand-nephew. Him, Doc, Doc Gray Stoker, I'm probably saying that wrong, uh, and J.D. Barker and is the prequel to the classic vampire novel, novel Dracula. So that is really interesting. So I will definitely be reading that. 
and I guess there um, there was one of two possibilities. You also could have gotten the hardcover of Devil's Day, which is a sophomore release by Andrew Michael Hurley. And for the My Favorite Holiday is Halloween Tote Bag Limited Edition, declare your devotion to the creepiest holiday of the year with this Halloween-inspired tote bag. And then the Stranger Things Library Bookmark. And that is a limited edition as well. Celebrating the upcoming book release of Stranger Things Worlds Turned Upside Down, the official behind the scenes companion. That is cool. And so that did say October 30th, you guys. So if you are a Stranger Things fan like myself, you will probably want to check out that um, behind the scenes companion book that comes out on the 30th. And then a horror movie inspired key tag. So, and you could have gotten one of 12 different horror movie themed key tag keychains. Creepy Crate, this is great. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. The stuff is awesome. Again, if you can wear or know someone who can wear a men's size small or like a unisex size small and you are into the serial killer H.H. Holmes, um, just comment down below uh, oh, I know. Comment down below Murder Castle because that is the H.H. H. Holmes Murder Castle T limited edition. So if that is something that you would like and would wear or know someone who would comment down below Murder Castle, someone will be picked at random and I will then get your mailing address from you in a private message and send it out to you. So thank you so much Creepy Crate. This is a great box. I really appreciate it. What did you guys think? Comment down below and let me know. And it, please, if you have not already, subscribe, hit the notification bell, which is the new subscribe. I, I know, you guys know this by now. But I have tons of videos that I'm uploading and some really, a couple that I'm really excited about that I hope you guys will enjoy that are not going to just be me standing here and, and talking. So hopefully you'll enjoy those. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I will see you on the next one and stay spooktacular.